The first Datsun car came into the world in 1933, just as the first page of Nissan Motor Company Limited was written. For 40 years since that time, Nissan has developed steadily. The old domestically made Austin A40 was rolled out by the company in 1956. Also in that year, a Datsun entry took the A-Class prize in the Australian Rally, and with this, the Datsun name sprang into fame the world over. In 1958, a Datsun exhibit at the Los Angeles Imported Car Show attracted special attention. A new type of Datsun 310 first appeared on the market in 1959. This proved to be the first great step of Nissan toward expansion beyond national boundaries. The following year, Nissan was awarded the Deming Prize, the supreme honor for quality control. That year also saw Nissan Motor Company in USA established the export of Datsuns now began to be stressed. Datsuns made an unexpectedly big hit. They were so well received that the Datsun came to rank second only to Volkswagen, among various other important makes in Hawaii. In 1961, Nissan Mexicana SA was established, with a view to starting local production of Datsuns in Mexico. Exports topped the 100,000 mark in 1963. In 1965, the first specialized car carrier vessel was launched to meet the growing demand for Datsuns overseas. 1967 was a year to remember in the field of speed records. For Nissan's prototype machine, R380, established seven international speed records. Hommoku Wharf in Yokohama. With this completion, Nissan's export program reached maturity. Datsun exports increased at such a pace that the one million mark was reached in 1968. the East African Safari Rally, one of the world's three biggest rally events. This rally is known as the most grueling, requiring entries to cover a 5,000 kilometer course in a five-day run. Datsun competed with other strong makes and captured the overall, class, and team prizes in 1970 and 1971. In the 1972 Monte Carlo Rally, a Datsun 240Z won a praiseworthy third place. By the end of 1973, 
the total number of Datsun cars exported had surpassed the three and a half million level. Constantly expanding Nissan offers the luxurious 260C, the all-round 180B, a reliable family car, the 160J, the quick and nimble 120Y, the unique and economical 100A, the exciting 260Z, and the dependable workhorse Datsun pickup truck. Great enthusiasm for research and development and the most up-to-date technologies are the two principal factors behind production of Datsuns. This is a photoelastic test to inspect the inside structure of a gear. Highly advanced electronics are employed to design a car which will be excellent both in performance and styling. The numerically controlled machine tools or the so-called NC machines. Tested here are various properties of the body styling with respect to pneumatic dynamics. A durability test of Datsun's four-wheel independent suspension, which enjoys a worldwide reputation. A durability test of the disc brakes. It is a continuous braking test at incredibly high speed and temperature. One of the safety considerations, the collapsible steering test. The collapsible steering is intended to protect the driver against bruises by telescoping in case of collision. A rollover test. It was confirmed that even in the case of rollover, the occupants were not thrown out and no fuel leakage was detected. These superb technologies have been fully incorporated in the development of Nissan's experimental safety vehicles. These vehicles completely satisfy a number of rigid specifications, such as passenger safety in collision traveling at 80 kilometers per hour. ESVs are excellent proof of the outstanding level of Nissan's technologies. Nissan's head office in Tokyo and manufacturing plants. All these plants are equipped with the most up-to-date facilities. This is a gigantic 6,000 ton forging machine in an automated forging line. Almost all the manufacturing processes are automatically operated. 
This is an automated line for gear processing. Transmission assembly is automated too. A press mill. Welding the body. On an assembly line, engines and various other parts separately manufactured are assembled into an automobile in an instant. One Datsun after another rolls off the line. With respect to exhaust gas problems, Nissan Central Research Laboratory has been studying effective countermeasures since as early as 1965. This smog chamber is designed to produce smog artificially by exposing exhaust gas to ultraviolet rays. The gas chromatograph is capable of analyzing as many as 126 ingredients of gasoline and gases. Development of a device for the recombustion of exhaust gas. A scan type electron microscope to examine surface conditions of catalysts. Directions from the control room automatically create various running conditions for consecutive 50,000 mile test running. Thus, in this way, Nissan strives untiringly to preserve the environment. One such effort, testing for the development of a rotary engine. A new mechanism of the cylinder head is a feature of the NVCC engine, aiming at ensured combustion. This is also one of the exhaust gas countermeasures.
completed debts and cars being transported from a plant for shipment to Nissan's Hommoku Wharf. Loading begins. Nissan's fleet of specialized export car carriers now numbers 12 vessels, which carried 710,000 cars abroad in 1973. Nissan Motors' expansion during the past 10 years has been so phenomenal that it has grown into a world enterprise with an annual production of two million cars, of which one third is exported. Datsun loving countries. Local assembly plants scattered throughout the world, number 22. Datsuns are always reliable friends. Romantic. And full of freshness. As a result, Nissan Motor enjoys popularity among motorists around the world. 